Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim Dawnguard. And I'm on my way to Darkfall Passage. Remember last time we got the uh, Canticle Bark and the Moths and all that. We read the Elder Scroll, killed some Dawnguard. And now we're on our way to find the uh, Mystical Orioles Bow. Orioles? Orioles? What am I thinking? Anyway, so Darkfall Passage is pretty much just on the map uh, around this area. I haven't found Markarth yet, but it more or less close to there. I believe Markarth is somewhere around here. So I went to Dragon Bridge and just traveled to there because uh, I found that on the way. But um, yeah, I went to Dragon Bridge and then just you know found my way over. It's not that hard. Just keep following the path. You'll eventually pick up on it. It's quite simple, really. All right, Darkfall Cave, my least favorite area in the game, but that's okay. And, uh, yeah, Serana, Serana somewhere. All right, so let's go on in. All right, Darkfall Passage. I'm going to go ahead and crouch for this because we haven't been crouching recently, which is not a good thing. Uh, we want our Calm Spell, but let's go ahead and switch to our crossbow for the time being. Just so we can sneak around a little bit. Do I have any poison? Because that would always help. Frostbite venom. Sweet. I don't know how long these last, but uh, we'll, we'll figure out. Figure. We'll figure out. We'll figure it out. Uh, so today I went to the dentist. And let me tell you, the doctor did not have any good news. I have two cavities in the back. on One on my wisdom tooth and one on the tooth before that. And the worst part is... Uh, I apparently don't have a bottom wisdom tooth on that side of my mouth, so the top wisdom tooth is actually, like, falling, in a sense, each time. Uh, well, not each time. It's, it's basically, it's just falling, like, down, so eventually it's going to grind into this into my jaw and cause some really bad problems for me. So, evidently, I need to get that cut out. Uh, I really... I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't really want to get that cut out. It's a freaking wisdom tooth. Come on, man. It's like... Is there anything back here at all? Oh, you know what? I'm, I'm pretty sure this is our escape out. Um, but yeah. I don't want to get my wisdom tooth cut out. Dude, like, my friend had all four of them cut out, and he was the most painful experience he's ever undergone. So, you know. Oh, some Moonstore. Moon Moonstore. Moonstone. So yeah, that's that's what's going on in my life. <laughs> that's uh, that's about it, really. So I'll let you guys know how that's going in another episode. If I actually decide to go through with it or not, because I, realistically, I think it'll be fine for a while. Um, it's not really like no, they have to pick here. It's not really bothersome in any sense currently. So yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump down here. I like this part. It's really, really nice and fun and you ready for the climax oh that part's so much fun whoa, whoa. and ready round two all right hey calm down calm down it's okay it's okay it's okay it's okay it's okay <laughs> kill it all right all right, Serana, go ahead and uh, reanimate one of those bad boys. All right. So, again, we are looking for Oriole's bow. So we're going to be traveling through this. Jeez! Dude, I swear, if that ever happened to me in real life, I would freak out. No lie. All right, relax, relax, relax. It's okay. Ha, <laughs> just kidding. No, it's not. Relax, relax. It's okay. Man, we're just like murdering these things. Cool. All right, let's go. Um, I'm pretty sure this place is only filled with spiders. Uh, probably, probably the. Uh, I see you. Check this out. Ready? Get get out of the way, Serana spider. Oh God, it's a giant one. Well, piss. Alright, relax, relax, relax. It'll be okay, man. Oh, 
Oh, just kidding. No, I won't. Hey! Hey! Yeah, that's right. You get a slow motion cutscene into your brain. Alright, so, uh, Serana, your, your, your reanimated spider was defective, so uh, I, had, I had to put it down. Uh, nothing over here, just a giant egg. Cool. Alrighty. So, going on up this way. I love these cave designs. Huh. Well. Let's, uh, let's read this. What's, what's going on here? Huh. Trolls. What is there a troll doing in here? Ooh. I kind of want that hat. Nah. Because they're probably stupid. Man, you guys left a lot of stuff in here. Sweet! And steel bolts. You guys are awesome. I, I love you people. Look at all this stuff. It's like left everything. Well, <laughs> I guess they're kind of dead and now, so really, uh, that's probably why they left everything, huh? Alright. Um, no, we need to go this way. Wait a second. We came that way. What, what's what's up here? I want to find out. So I think I went down before. Huh. Uh, I guess that's another entrance you could have gone in. Wow, this place is nice. It's it's pretty. Look at this. Oh, cool. Can we go up here? Um. Oh, yeah, we can. I was gonna say it doesn't look like it. Sweet. Okay. All right. Can we go up any higher? Nope. That looks like it. So let's go this way, and pull chain. All right. Oh, hey, look at that. Well, we could go on that ride again. We could go down the waterfall, but I'm not going to do that because that's a waste of time. All right. Um, all right. Let's go back down that way and we'll... Remember that trap we saw down there? That's that's what I remember. So we're going down this time. All right. And jump over trap. Serana's going to set it off, isn't she? That jerk. But that's okay. Serana doesn't know any better. And yeah. All right, let's sneak around in here because I feel like there's. Yep, she set it off. <laughs> That's okay. No problem, Serana. As long as it didn't hurt me, we're good. All right. Looks like we're at the main apex of the cave. Is apex even the right word? I'm not sure. But it's okay. Oh, hey, look, a bunch of trolls. Ooh, we can have some fun with these guys. Because I have a frenzy spell. No. Don't worry, this is gonna make him freak out, Serana. Oh, that didn't work. Got it! Okay, now they're gonna fight each other. Alright, Serana, come over here. We gotta we gotta hide. It's my lint! <laughs> no no. It's my lint! No one's gonna touch my lint! <laughs> I don't know. Anybody ever seen that episode of Garage Scarily Dog? Probably not, but. I don't know. I did that impression horribly. Why aren't you two fighting each other? Alright, so while they're doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and sneak over here. And, uh, see what's in this treasure chest. Nice, nice. Some good stuff. Ooh. Gold necklace. Where'd they go? Did, did the one already kill the other? Well, that's kind of cool. Alright. I can dig it. Hey, bro. I'm just a troll. Dirt! That didn't work. Oh, okay, relax, relax, relax. It's okay. Hey, Serana, you deal with that one, alright? Holy crap! You can't sneak up on these guys. Alright. Um... Calm down, calm down. It's okay. It's alright. It's alright. Alright, cool. They can be snuck up on. Good. 
I was gonna say, this is like the only way I can exploit any weakness in any enemy. <laughs> so. Alright then. That was easy enough. Alright! We found... Glockenspiel! My favorite character in the game! Just kidding, I don't know him. He's, he's, you're gonna love this part. Come forward. You have nothing to fear. Here. Yeah, I do. I am Knight Paladin Gelibor. Welcome to the Great Chantry of Oriel. Oriel, Oriel, Halkosh, Akatosh, so many different names for the Sovereign of the Snow Elves. I prefer Snow Elf. The name Falmer usually holds a negative meaning to most travelers. Those twisted creatures you call Falmer, I call the Betrayed. Of course, you're here for Oriel's bow. Why else would you be here? I can help you get it, but first, I must have your assistance. I need you to kill Archcurate Vertha, my brother. The kinship between us is gone. I don't understand what he's become, but he's no longer the brother I once knew. It was the betrayed. They did something to him. I just don't know why Oriel would allow this to happen. They swept into the Chantry without warning, and began killing everyone without pause. The Chantry was a place of peaceful worship. I led a small group of paladins, but we were no match for the Betrayed's sheer numbers. They slaughtered everyone, and stormed the inner sanctum where I believe they corrupted Vertha. He's alive. I've seen him, but something's wrong. He never looks as though he's in pain or under duress. He just stands there and watches, as though waiting. Leaving the Way Shrines unguarded would be violating my sacred duty as a Knight Paladin of Oriel, and an assault on the Betrayed guarding the Inner Sanctum would only end with my death. Yes, let me show you. Alright, so he's gonna show us that. Let's uh, get some blessings here. Alright, so let's watch what he's gonna do. Okay, I was gonna say, what's going on here? This is snow elf magic. Incredible. What are you doing, Serana? This structure is known as a way shrine. They were used for meditation and for transport when the Chantry was a place of enlightenment. Prelates of these shrines were charged with teaching the mantras of Oriel to our initiates. What's that basin in the center signify? Once the initiate completed his mantras, He'd dip a ceremonial ewer in the basin of the Way Shrine center and proceed to the next Way Shrine. So these initiates had to lug around a heavy pitcher of water. Marvelous. How long would they have to do that? Well, once the initiate's enlightenment was complete, he'd bring the ewer to the Chantry's inner sanctum. Pouring the contents of the ewer into the sacred basin of the sanctum would allow him to enter for an audience with the Arch Curate himself. All that just to end up dumping it out? It makes no sense to me. It's symbolic. I don't expect you to understand. So, let's get this straight. We need to do all that nonsense to get into the temples so we can kill your brother and claim Ariel's bow. I know how it all sounds. But if there was another way, I'd have done it long ago. The only way to get to my brother is by following in the Initiate's footsteps and traveling from Way Shrine to Way Shrine, just as they did. The first lay at the end of Darkfall Passage, a cavern that represents the absence of enlightenment. There are five in total, spread far apart across the Chantry. Caves? Oh no! The Chantry encompasses far more than a few caves, as you'll soon discover. But before I send you on your way, you'll need the Initiate's Ewer. Oh boy! Once you've located a way shrine, there'll be a spectral prelate tending to it. They will allow you to draw the waters from the shrine's basin, as if you'd been enlightened. This may be the last time we're able to converse. If you have any questions before you leave, I suggest you ask them. Otherwise, all I can do now is grant you my hopes for a safe journey. Okay, so, my least favorite part of this DLC again, but it's alright. We're gonna get through it because, yeah. 
So, basically what we gotta do is go to the, each of the five little way shrines as before in Darkfall Passage, fill up the ewer, then find the giant castle thingy. So, we're gonna do that next episode, so I will see you in Darkfall Passage next time. Alright, thank you very much for watching, go ahead and like this video, subscribe, do whatever you feel you need necessary, and I'll see you next time, thanks for watching, bye bye.